Hey guys, this is what we're dealing with today. And we're gonna beat it down. Let's go. Hey, what's happening guys? We're playing Remnant from the Ashes here. And uh, we just got through another area. And we are at a boss. A cavern boss. Look at this. This, is, this looks sweet. Um, if you like the type of content that I'm producing, please comment, like, subscribe to all my YouTube videos. That would be great. Oh, this looks sick. Is this the beast? Oh, wow. Look at this thing. I don't know about that. Yeah. Definitely a cool boss fight, I like this. Controller batteries are low, I'm well aware. Can these be shot? Oh, okay, they can be shot. Uh oh. I'm in trouble. What? All right, let's do it. Let's see what we got here, boys. Let's go, baby. Take him out. Let's go. I don't think that hit me. Seal up. Come on. What am I taking damage from? Come on. Shoot. I'm in trouble. Yo, that didn't hit me. Come on. I think this should be the kill right here. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! That was a really tough fight. 
Nice. The Hive Stone. Oh, right. Executioner. Look at that trait. Oh, they knew it was a tough one, too. They even give you two chests afterwards. And Guardian's Heart. Forged Iron. Scrap. Look at all that. Scrap, scrap, forged iron. Wow, look at this. Yeah, they're just throwing us so much stuff. Adrenaline, forged iron. Look at this. Wow. Corroded. Yeah, I am definitely corroded. Okay, well, I think that's kind of the end of the road here. Right? They just want us to go backwards at this point. Bag's full. Let's see what we have. Let's see what we got there. Um, um, let's see. Reduce the sway. Um, let's see what we get for the hive stone powerful weapon from the hive stone and we have the guardian's heart which we can choose who we want to give that to we also have the executioner oh critical hit chance bonus yeah definitely nice oh wow if you put like 20 points into executioner if you have a 20 percent crit chance that's crazy you we used to stack crit chance on our heroes in world of warcraft you would uh i played as a warlock and this was in the Burning Crusade expansion when we were raiding and through Black Temple, Serpent Shrine Cavern, and uh, uh, I can't remember what Kael Thassa's instance was called. I think it was like uh, the Void or something like that. Anyways, uh, you would start stacking haste and crit chance at the end of your uh, raiding cycle once you start getting high end tier 5 and tier 6. And that would allow you to do like six, seven K damage crits, something like that. I used to make YouTube videos when I was like 17, post them up and just show my guy just throwing out these absolute gnarly shadow bolts that were just ripping so hard. I had, uh, I think it was like Terran Gore Fiend. I did one of, uh, Garrosh Hellscream. Uh, I don't think I did one of Supremus. And then uh, Mother Shazra, the, I think it was called the Twilight Council, and then Illidan. Um, I missed a boss or two in there. High Warlord Nagentis. That was fun. Those were the days, man. World of Warcraft's best game ever made. There's like, there's no competition either. War World of Warcraft's in such a league of its own. Back in the day, at least. I think the new World of Warcraft ah, sucks. Um... They ruined it through taking away the experience from the player. Um, let's see here. Armor? Yeah, if we can keep upgrading. Yeah, cool. Be safe out there. Okay, we'll upgrade the armor a little more. What? Let's see, what right, can then. we get? That's crazy. Hive Cannon. You know I gotta see what this thing does. We'll get the Swarm too. This Devastator stinks though. I don't like the Devastator at all. I mean, I didn't even actually use it. Maybe I'm just You're stupid. Maybe I should be using these boss yeah. weapons and I'm making my playthrough a lot more chat. difficult than it has to be. I probably am, to be honest. Um, Let's see though. What was that new mod I just got? The swarm. We can try the swarm out for sure. Did that change my loadout a little bit? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. It put it put uh, a unique bandage and green thing on my weapon. That was cool. Um, what was the other Keep gun moving. though? The hive cannon. This is what I wanted to see. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about the Hive Cannon. Let's upgrade it, though. I don't want to put it down and say it sucks automatically. I feel like I do that with most what weapons. Do you need? What does this need? Iron? 
Wow, it's expensive to upgrade this thing now. Oh, hive shot's pretty Take cool. Care, I bet it's the mods that really make the specialty weapons. I, I wonder if the weapons are actually that much better or that much worse, but the mods on them, because they have the boss mods, are really strong. That's probably the deal. Okay, so um, I'm going to give the heart to that insect lady. I think I just like the insect stuff more. Should I... I feel like whoever I betray is then going to be the final boss. That guardian. Yeah, let's let's just kill the guardian in uh, Rom instead. Uh, the, the elf queen, whatever. We don't need to kill the elf queen. So we've gone through Earth, Rom, and Corsus now. Is there a fourth area is the question. I think I remember there being a fourth area. Because we haven't even touched galvanized iron yet. We haven't ascended our weapons plus level 10. And that's something I definitely want to do and see what is all about. Alright. Come on. There we go. Let's see. Outsider, please approach. You have done it. The Iskal saw it all. Will you give us its heart? Okay. It will be forever in Let's do it. Yes. Yes. And here, as promised, we adore conversation. I'd like to see your wares. We are elite. Slayer Mantle. You can buy a scythe from her. That's pretty pretty sweet. Look at that thing. Return often, clean. Okay, now what is this uh, Slayer armor? Increases damage done. After a reload. Okay, let's see how my guy looks. Oh, that freaking mask is ridiculous. I think I like the Osseus armor bonuses more than the Slayer armor, to be honest. That was cool, though, I guess. Um, so Corsus is not defeated, obviously. There's only four. There's gotta be a fifth area. Did I miss something? No. I didn't miss anything. Hmm. First time I've been actually confused as to where to go next. I'm gonna go talk to, uh, that other guy that we didn't give the heart to. The Undying Throne. I bet this guy's pissed and he turns into, like, a boss or something. We also have that, like, waypoint area that we went to, but we never actually could go into any of those portals. So I'm going to need to inspect those as well. Um, if this ends up being nothing, I'm going to figure out on my own what to do. And then I will, once I figure out what to do, post it in another video. Hall of the Undying, you have betrayed me. And let's be honest, let's get this hunting rifle off. Back to the shotgun. The hot shot with the shotgun's awesome. How few the hunt. How terribly uninteresting. Arrogant child. Attend to. There is an intruder. All right. That's what I thought. Wow. 
What? My guy never even blinked. He literally did not blink. Like, my screen never got red, so I just, like, died. Um, this armor set stinks. Osseus is so much better. After you kill people, you get a massive damage bonus. Why would I not use it? Um, I also don't know how I feel about that being a plus one versus a plus ten. All right, now we're G'd up. Now we're ready to go. Have you the... How dead? Arrogant child. Okay. Attend! There is an imp... Oh. Stay down. Did these things need to be shot? Yeah. Okay. Kill the ads first. Yo. I almost want to watch the replay on that and see how fast that guy. Because it, it just doesn't seem like it's very. Um, it's not a slow way to go. It's like you just go from full health to nothing when he starts hitting you with those sights. So, I'm imagining that I'm going to want to keep my distance on this guy then, because those things are crazy. Have you Refuse. No, I will never get to hire. Attend to me. There right. is an I liked killing the ads, though. That was good. Okay, that's just ridiculous that I missed at all. That was just so stupid that my shotgun is right in the middle. I'm shooting it. Ugh, it that was so pathetically bad. Those hitboxes are terrible. A hitbox is um, essentially just an area around an object that can have collisions. And uh, I don't know how they can't went up with the shotgun shell hitboxes. I'm imagining it's not the object itself. It was probably just the bullets. I don't know if they sprayed them randomly. Sometimes to create a more realistic effect on shotguns and video games, they will add like a random I'll algorithm to the bullets so they like spray around differently. So, uh, but I don't know I if I just got unlucky or if that was just not much randomness to it. I think, uh, what a terrible start this is. Up, and I gotta dodge. There you go. Just reload the whole thing. I like don't really know how to dodge that thing. It's kind of annoying. Like, 
what do you even do to that? Okay, so I clearly don't know how to beat this fight. Also, I'm going to need a lot more practice. I'm just getting beat up. Uh, we're going to call the episode here. Guys, if you're liking the content that I'm producing, like, comment, subscribe on all the YouTube videos, and get in on the uh, Discord server as well. It'd be great to hear from everybody. Um, so, yeah, we're going to stop here. I'm going to have to practice on this guy a whole bunch to actually see what I'm doing and, you know, try to beat this guy. So, all right. Later, guys. Bye.